back again with another episode of Sippin' Saturdays. I think it's episode 12. If I'm not numbers. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, we're on 12 right now. So tell us about today's episode. What's the theme? The theme is exotic fruits. Yes, it's all about the exotic fruits today. Yes, it's not and necessarily only from the Caribbean. You can find it in other islands as well. Definitely. All right, what you got lined up? There's a lot. I don't know where to start. All right. As long as you touch something. <laughs> okay. All right. So we're going to start off with something popular. A lot of people like the the Moscow Mule. So we're going to do a, a guava Moscow Mule. A guava Moscow Mule. Yes. Is that um something that's really... Something you can actually get? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was going to ask. A little bit different. It's yeah. always different here. And Peroy will always come to the yeah. answers the call. Yeah. Different or not. Or a passion fruit. So we'll do a passion fruit too. That you can find. So we're we starting with. Well, we're gonna start with the guava. So we got a whole lime. Have to go through to get those. I had to go to the fruit market. And they look like this on the inside. We're just gonna squeeze that in. Toss the skin. Ginger beer. Which ginger beer is this, is this one? This one is the Q. Okay. And what we're going to do is we're going to give it a splash of the guava juice. Stir that together. Get some honor, as always. Let's start a show. Trying to get you one, one for the road. No, none for the road. Give that another stir. We're gonna do a lime for the garnish. I don't want to run outside again. Go get some mint leaves. <laughs> and we're just gonna do that. And there you go. You got yourself a guava Moscow mule. And you can make that with any of the fruits that we have here. So you can do it with the star fruit. You can do it with the mango. You can do it with the passion fruit. You can do it with papaya, sour salt. It's all good. That one looks refreshing. Yes. Summer's over, but you know. The fun has never stopped with blue. Exactly. And we're gonna do a little simple drink. This anyone can do at home. Something I could do. Something you can do. One, two, three. Okay, ready? I love those. <laughs> One. You want to know how I messed up already? How? I said step one, put three cubes of ice. <laughs> <laughs> Fill your glass almost to the top with ice. Some ice in your shaker. So far, so good. I could do that. We're gonna do some berry pineapple passion fruit juice. The Royal. Chase. Frosty. And 
four. That is pretty. Okay. We're gonna garnish this one with a lime. Good. Pretty. All right. So uh, the famous fruit of all. Everybody loves the mango. I don't think I've ever really met anyone that doesn't like mango. <laughs> so we're gonna be extra exotic on this one. So we're gonna do mango. We're gonna just slice it through. And I've seen people actually just do it with uh, on the side of a glass. I just kind of just go down. Just to be a little, we're only gonna use half. See how beautiful this mango is? Oh. And this is a, actually a Philippines mango. I'm gonna slice it up. Um. Anybody on? Uh, I got, I think, two, two three people. Okay. I mean, it's nice out. I think everybody's probably out. Enjoying the nice weather. No excuses. <laughs> they got phones in their hands. Mango. And to your shaker. Dragon fruit. Man. Okay, so you can actually take the inside out of this and puree it and use the fresh juice. But I did find that Welch's has a dragon fruit mango juice you put that with blue royal that's it yeah, you don't need anything else <laughs> so we're just gonna take a spoon of this see how i just go around with a spoon and the seeds are edible we're gonna use half throw that in there Some sugar cane, the famous sugar cane. Yes. This has been soaking, so we've got some of that in here. Like I said, you can always do this, leave it in the fridge when you're ready for a cocktail. Just pull it out. Pull it out. <laughs> okay. but sugar cane works well because the rum already is already made with um, sugar cane. With the agave. Educated ice, because the liquor is already soaked into the ice in the shaker. And we pour. That's like a drink and a breakfast. <laughs> And if you um you kind of google these fruits they all have some type of benefits for the body not that i'm saying that it's gonna heal you when you <laughs> mix it with liquor however <laughs> <laughs> you know you're not putting all that extra sugar and stuff into yeah, your body i'm saying it's gonna heal you the blue oil is holy water how <laughs> <laughs> you melted to god and you melted back then i sold it to you <sighs> all right star fruit Star fruit. Oh, we're getting. So we're going to cut 
one. This is, uh, remember how I say all the time, we're gonna look like we're fancy, but we're not. Just cut the star fruit. I'm gonna do two pieces. Get some ice in my glass. I'm gonna stick one of the star fruit. Antoine said we, do, we fancy Antoine Van Boos are one of the, one of our um, avid fans. Man, cool guys. You said we, we fancy with the holy water and that. <laughs> holy water. And then we're going to put another one on this side. Antoine, I see you, um, I see you guys doing big things with, uh, with the new show you got. I got to talk to you about that one time. It looks pretty good, man. Proud of you guys. Keep up the good work. And we're just gonna peel this out of this. And star fruit is actually really good for everything. You can actually make a juice out of it. Maybe. Maybe we'll make a little juice soon. Well, that's what we're doing now, kind of, but not a whole thing. it into pieces and it does have a core Mush. and it's just molding it now mm -hmm. and you'll get to see all the juice that's coming out it's like a lemon hint why we're gonna use some lemonade star fruit lemonade Every lemonade, mm -hmm. a little sweet and sour. Some seltzer. Well, we'll put the seltzer after to top it off. And we're gonna use sugarcane blue. That is just blue oil soaked in sugarcane. with the sugarcane over no a couple sugar, days. Nothing. nothing else added, you right. We're gonna actually strain it because of the fact that we don't want all that pulp in there. And we pour. Patrick Star and it looks like it looks like plankton just floating oh, down. Oh god. And garnish on the top too? Yes. Oh, Alright, we're gonna do an oldie but a goodie. This one was inspired by Rashid. Yes. I think uh, he got a little held up today. He was supposed to be live, but I know, running out of room here. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we got some sour sop. Sour sop. I love sour sops. I was trying to find a fresh fruit, but it, that was mission impossible. Seasoned. <laughs> so uh, I did get some sour sop pulp, which is all organic. It has no sugar added and all that, no preservative, nothing. So we're gonna put some of this in here. And this one, Mr. Blue CEO can actually do as well. All you do is squeeze it up, sour sauce. Or you can get the juice. They do sell the juice. The nectar, I should say. So nice. Blue Yardy claimed the, the star. Yes. <laughs> I knew he would. <laughs> and some blue? A, a little bit more blue than no. that. What do you mean? I'll no. give you a little splash of your sugar okay. cane blue. I'm good with that. Well, that wasn't a splash. Man. I said a splash. That was that exactly was, a splash. That was a drip. People, that was a splash. That was a drip. Shake. <laughs> Mr. 
make sure you shake it well because the sour sop is thick. And pour. but a goodie. Nice. See, even Blue Roy, Blue um, Blue Yardy agreed with me. He said that wasn't a, <laughs> he, was like, he said that's a pinch. <laughs> a pinch, that's a splash. A splash. This is nice. Yeah, so this is more like an after dinner kind of drink. It's okay. more of a dessert, you know. Who needs when you can have sour sauce? Ooh. <laughs> and blue. Shots fired. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. I don't know. All right. So we also had, this is also inspired by, uh, shout out to the bartender, Frankie. Frankie, yes. Yeah, so Frankie Frank came up once a blue. Frankie for real. Once in a blue. Once in a blue. Um, I'm just going to do a little twist to it. We're not going to go the extra like he does. He infuses it. He's got all this thing. We're just going to do it while we're at home kind of thing. So I found some coconuts. Bear with me because... Uh, How are you going to put the hole in that? I don't know. We're going to find out. Well, I guess like that. <laughs> I work miracles, guys. Miracles. We're going to stick the knife. Oh, there's already coconut water in there. You need yourself a little funnel. And all you need is two shots of blue. Um, some blue. some of this sugar cane. We're going to use the sugar cane because they're going to eat all the sugar cane by today. Guaranteed. <laughs> A couple minutes. We just kind of swirl that around. Huh. Give yourself a straw. And that's it. <laughs> we actually call that a blue wave. <laughs> Or ocean blue. Or ocean blue. But I didn't put the blue caraco only because of the fact that we're if you're gonna eat the inside of the coconut and it looks like it's a meaty coconut, it's gonna dye it blue. And I don't think that tastes so good. So we're gonna do just the plain and the blue royal, so it's kinda like a soaking in there. It's gonna hit the spot once you crack that coconut open. Okay. We already Rolo had two of those coconuts. I think he did have one of yours. <laughs> They were delicious. Those coconut put me to work. <laughs> work, I tell you. Um, all right. Guess what? What? You gotta come up with a bonus. Woohoo! The bonus? Right you now I can do, do it. Bonus. So bonus. We're gonna do a exotic bowl. Ooh. I So, we're gonna build it right in the bowl. All right. Okay, so we had guava juice, papaya juice, um, the dragon fruit juice. Oh my God. Set. See if you put that much strippers, I'm waiting to see the blue oil. Okay. Okay. 
that's how, that's how I need you to drive from now on. <laughs> from now on, that's how you drive. Uh, when you pour in Blue Royal, that's how you pour. We got Blue Royal. Um, we're gonna do a little sour sop on the top. Give that a stir. And here we go. We're gonna put a starfish, some dragon fruit. Ooh, I missed that one. Dragon fruit, he ate it. He ate it. It's good. We had some pomegranate. I didn't get to do to that part. So we're gonna do. Pomegranate seed. Fresh passion fruit. Mm -hmm. I thought that was a good idea. It's passion fruit in English, by the way, guys. <laughs> English. <laughs> I can't with this guy. Oh, and we're. Got sugar cane on the inside. Again, we just look fancy. We're not necessarily fancy. And there you go. That's your bowl. She is. Blue Yardy says next live he wants to be here so he can sample. <laughs> My guy, every Saturday, 2.30, the show goes off. Every drink gets a, a claim. Somebody claims one of them. Don't here. worry. Here we go. One more time. All right. We got three minutes. What you got for me? All right. So if anybody who follows me, or I think Blue Royal also, I made some Blue Royal sorbet. Dang, how'd you do that? With some um, simple syrup, blue royal, uh, frozen mango, and mango juice. That's it. That's it. Blend it, put it in the freezer, you got yourself a nice sorbet. What's the difference between a sorbet and ice cream then? There's no cream, no dairy. Oh, I knew that. dessert. I didn't see Blue Royal on it yet. There's Blue Royal in <laughs> in the sorbet. You can see it. Sorbet. <laughs> there you go. All right. Guess what time it is? Recap. 229, 229 right 229. now. Perfect timing. I right do have some time. papaya. I'll mix this. I have some papaya so I can chop this papaya up. I have some frozen um, sour sop. Put them together, add blue, delicious. Cool. This, we got a lot lined up right now. Yes. All right, recap time. Oh, let me line them up. It's eight drinks today. All right, first, the oh, coconut one. The coconut one is just coconut water and blue oil. That's it. Cool. Easy money. This one is the the guava mule. Mm -hmm. So you don't have to have fresh guava. You can actually just get the frozen ones if you can find them. You can do that too. Um, ginger beer, guava, blue royal, and lime. All right, and that's the garnish? And the garnish is the lime. All but right. the lime juice also goes with the ginger beer. Okay. Um, this Next is up. the one, two, three, blue CEO special, easy yes. breezy. Or we can call this Blue CEO, Easy Breezy. Easy Breezy. Um, so what, what was that? <laughs> that was the passion fruit, pineapple, berry juice. 
and Blue Royal. Shake it, that's it. Garnish with a lime. Got it. Dragon Fruit and Mango. This one is the Dragon Fruit Mango Juice with uh, fresh, uh, past, uh, fresh dragon fruit and fresh mangoes. Muller together, Blue Royal, top it off, and that's it. All right, and this one's the Sour Sop. Sour Sop and Blue Royal. Shake it up and pour. And that was it? That was it. So I could do that one as well. Okay, now this the star one. The star fruit. The Patrick star. One star fruit. Peel, take your seed out, muller it, uh, splash of lemonade and Blue Royal, and that's it. Cool. And then the fish Exotic bowl. Exotic bowl. Got it. The exotic bowl has the guava juice, the dragon fruit juice, the papaya juice, and soursop, blue royal, triple sec. Top it off with all the fruits that you have in there. Pomegranate, dragon fruit, star, all of it. With the sugar cane for with garnish? With the sugar cane for the garnish. Mm -hmm. Sugar cane's more like a shot than it is a garnish, by the way. Yeah, it's been soaking. It's been soaking. And then this is dessert. the cocktail dessert. So this is the mango sorbet, which is blue royal, mango, mango nectar, and that's it. Blend it. And, and, and then you have the sour sap. Sour on top. sap, just a drizzle on top, just to make it look good. Got it. All right, people. That was a quick recap. Time is up, 2.30 on the dot. Um, anything that is here is really, truly simple enough where you could grab a bottle of Blue Royal and stay home and make that happen to yourself. Yes. Thanks for joining us for another episode of Sippin' Saturdays. This exotic episode was pretty fun, I must say. And I didn't even get to do all of them. Right? <laughs> we got so much to get to. But we will be enjoying all this right now. If you do happen to make any, um, post tag them up, post. tag us so we can see what your creation is. Yes. And the one that actually looks the closest to it, or even better, do your own twist. You might be in the running for a Blue Royal merch. We'll figure out which one it is. If it's going to be a sweatshirt like this one, a vintage one, a hoodie, t-shirt, you know, you name it. We'll figure that out. Yes. But... So, in the meantime, join us next week. Same blue time. Same blue channel. I think next week we're doing pumpkin. It's the season. It's the season. Stay safe out there, people. Mm -hmm.